was not only President Jomo Kenyatta's personal physician, but also one of Kenyatta's three most powerful confidants. Magana Njoroge Mungai was born in 1926 in Dagoretti Division of Nairobi. He went to the Presbyterian Church Elementary School in Kikuyu before joining nearby Alliance High School, then the leading boarding secondary school for Kenyan Africans. On leaving Alliance in 1945, Mungai attended Fort Hare University in South Africa, from which he graduated with a Bachelor of Science degree in 1950. From Fort Hare, Mungai proceeded to Stanford University in the US, then as today, one of the top universities in the world, where he obtained a BA degree in 1952. He would thereafter attend Stanford Medical School and receive his medical degree in 1957, thereby becoming the first Kenyan to be trained as a doctor in the United States. Later he would pursue further medical studies at Columbia University. Mungai came back to Kenya in 1959 and set up the Chania chain of clinics around the Dagoretti area of Nairobi from which he dispensed affordable medical treatment. The Kenya Mungai came back to was undergoing many political changes. On October 20th, 1952 The colonial governor in Kenya, Sir Evelyn Baring, had declared a state of emergency throughout Kenya in an effort to combat the Mau Mau armed rebellion, which had broken out in parts of central province against British rule. That day, many leaders of the only countrywide African political party, the Kenya African Union (CAU), including the party's president Jomo Kenyatta, were arrested, later tried and jailed for their part in the Mau Mau rebellion. After serving their jail terms, Kenyatta and his co-accused would be kept in detention for a number of years. Mungai would be one of the doctors who visited Kenyatta in his detention. All that time, African leaders would agitate for their release from detention even though the leaders would end up forming in 1960 two rival national political parties, the Kenya African National Union (KANU) and the Kenya African Democratic Union (KADU). Mungai was among those who helped draw up the constitution of Kanu, whose interim president was James Kishuru. Kenyatta and his co-detainees were released in August 1961, and Mungai became his physician. Soon thereafter, Kenyatta took over as president of Kanu and would later lead his party's delegation to the Second Constitutional Conference in February 1962 at Lancaster House in London, at which the final touches to the path to Kenya's independence were worked out. At that conference, it was agreed that Kenyans would go to the polls in a national election in May 1963. and that the country would be independent of British rule on December 12th that year. Mungai decided to vie for the Nairobi West seat and had Kenyatta's blessing in his political quest. Not only was he Kenyatta's personal physician, but he was also an in-law. Mungai's nephew, Yudige Shaga, was married to one of Kenyatta's daughters, Jane. Mungai won the Nairobi West seat easily. And in that election, Kano as a party emerged victorious, winning 83 of the 124 seats in the House of Representatives. On June 1st, 1963, Kenyatta, as leader of the majority in parliament, became the first prime minister of Kenya. In the government that he set up, Kenyatta appointed Mungai Minister for Health and Housing. a portfolio he would retain when Kenyatta formed his 15-member cabinet on Kenya attaining independence on December 12th that year. 